Hello everybody, I'm Leo from Daddy's Game Time, your friendly show about gaming, movies, and pop culture. And today we're going to be bringing you some tips for safe and healthy Pokemon Go walks. Number one. Now, you may have heard about a few accidents in the news uh, that are going around related to Pokemon Go. And this is a very important one, possibly the most important uh, safety tip that I can give you is be aware of your surroundings. You don't walk into the middle of the streets because you might get hit by a car or a motorcycle. Uh, be careful into bumping into other people as well. Uh, it's just uh, good etiquette to kind of, you know, uh, be nice and, and, and uh, be seen in a good light because uh, you are representing gamers everywhere uh, as you go out in the streets. I've heard about people uh, almost falling over bridges and there was actually one incident where somebody did fall over a cliff so just be careful you know sometimes there may be construction work going on uh, in your town on your street in your city uh, wherever you go so just always be aware of your surroundings number two stay hydrated I can't emphasize this enough. A lot of people that aren't used to going out um, and going for long walks or jogs, this applies to you joggers as well, um, you need to stay hydrated. Being hydrated means that your brain is gonna continue uh, to function the way it was designed to function. And it helps you with your gaming as, as well as with your health. Uh, remember to stay hydrated. Uh, try to stay away from those sugary drinks such as uh, uh, sodas, for example. Nothing beats water. Number three, now this is uh, kind of Hikers 101. Uh, always bring a snack. You know, you might be in the middle of a long walk, a long hike, or even in the middle of a long jog. And one thing that a lot of people forget about is bringing a snack. Uh, along with hydration, you also need a snack to keep alert, to keep um, your mind sharp, like crackers, cheese is okay too. Um, something that's gonna keep you kind of healthy. After all, the part of the point of going out uh, with this game is to try to improve your health, get you moving, and um, you might as well kill two birds with one stone, right? Your gaming and your health. So bring a healthy snack. Number four, weather protection. And by weather protection, I mean either sun or cold. You know, you don't want to be stuck in the sun without protection. Wear a hat, wear your sunglasses if that helps you for your eyes. I know a lot of people can be very sensitive to sunlight because of all the harmful UV rays that, uh, that there just is out in nature, right? Um, also, um, you may wanna wear some sunscreen or a long sleeve shirt to protect you from the sun. Um, wear nice, comfortable shoes along with that. It goes a long way. Um, keeping everything healthy and ready to go. Now, weather protection also applies to if you're going out late, if it's starting to get dark out, it's gonna get really cold within a few minutes. Also, maybe bring a sweater or something that may help keep you warm. You know, dress for the occasion, be safe when you go out. Number five, always be visible. Now, what does that mean, be visible? What I mean by that, always stay in lighted areas if you're gonna go out at night. Um, also stay in very visible areas as well where if you happen to get hurt, other people may be walking by if it's a busy area and they can see that you need help, they, they're more likely to stop and actually offer you some help. Uh, in some cases, people may get hurt by simply falling or tripping over something. Um, there may be a neighborhood uh, dog that's loose and he happens to be very territorial. I know these are extreme cases, but there have been other cases where there are thugs out there that have been uh, picking on Pokemon players um, for whatever the reasons are, but um, it hasn't happened quite yet where somebody gets hurt really badly, but it definitely 
can lead to that. There is potential for that. So just remember, be safe, be visible. Always stay in areas where there's going to be a lot of people to witness if you need help and be there uh, to help protect yourself. So those are five tips for safe and healthy Pokemon Go walks. Now remember, you can visit our website at daddysgametime.com. You can check us out facebook.com slash daddysgametime. You can also check out our merchandise, facebook.com slash merchandise. We're also on Twitch, we're on Twitter, we're on Instagram, you name it, we'll probably be there. We're all at keyword daddysgametime. Now remember, enjoy your games and love your families.